What's going on gardeners? On today's two minute garden tip, I'm going to show you how to hand pollinate corn so you can have the biggest, fullest ears of corn possible in your backyard garden. Corn is a self-fertile plant producing both male and female parts. The male flowers are located at the tops of the plants and are called tassels. As the tassel ripens, pollen is shed. The female parts are located on the lower parts of the plant. The female flowers are the silks. Each individual silk strand is connected to one kernel of corn. In order to have a full ear of corn, each individual silk must be pollinated. Full pollination occurs when male pollen touches each individual strand of silk. Seeing the layout of a stalk of corn, you'd think pollination would be easy and male pollen would simply rain down on top of the silks. However, corn is actually wind pollinated and wind does not blow down, it blows across. Actual data shows 97% of an ear's pollination comes from other plants. This is simple in large cornfields because winds blow giant clouds of pollen across the entire field, resulting in great pollination. In backyard plots, this phenomenon doesn't occur and pollen can actually blow in the wrong direction. So small corn patches like mine often have poor ear development with kernels missing from poor pollination. In order to pollinate corn efficiently in small gardens, wait until the silks emerge. Then wait for perfectly dry weather with no rain or morning dew and light or calm winds. Then either shake the tassels to distribute pollen all over the silks or snap a few of the tassels off and use them as feather dusters to spread pollen on the silks. And that's all there is to it. You generally want to do this as soon as the silks emerge and repeat regularly until all the corn silks in the ears turn brown. Keep in mind that if you're growing multiple varieties of corn, they will cross pollinate. Corn pollen has been documented to travel up to half a mile. So if you want to save true seed, you can only grow one variety of corn. And that's today's two minute garden tip. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell to receive new video notifications and check out our Amazon storefront and spread shop in the video description for a list of the gardening products I use and awesome custom designed apparel and other gear. Your support is greatly appreciated.